Cassie and Hans. It's Mike at Mark War Toyota. How you doing? Here, I'll spin around and say hi. Hey, it's nice to meet you folks. Hey, I really appreciate your interest in the Sequoia. Um, as you can see, it's right in the front of the building here. Uh, that's not necessarily the greatest news in the world because there's a yellow hold sign in it. Um, there's a, another one of our salespeople here that has somebody coming in today on it from Rochester. So anyway, I will uh, be glad to kind of keep you posted uh, whether it did sell, but I wanted to make you the video regardless, just in case. And I'm gonna cry if it sells because this thing is, it's really nice. Um, the uh, rims, fantastic. Tires, tons of tread left on them. Uh, as you go down the side of this, I, I, I really, I kind of did a little quick walk around too. It's really, really in good shape. And underneath here too, you know, just so you know, the person that had it too, there was a scratch there and they touched it up. And obviously it's wet here too, but I wanted to show you down there, nothing for rust uh, at all on it. Yeah, and the person was really diligent about touching up little spots on it. Tiny bit of pitting on the rims, but for the year, it's very, very minimal. And it does have the Michelins on it, just so you know, so even better. Going around to the back, just in a fantastic condition. Oops, move it up a bit there. I'd like to show you down here. I was kind of looking down below there. You've got the hitch and it's got the seven pin adapter on it. Uh, there's hardly a mark on the back end at all either. Got the chrome exhaust as well. Show you this side. They fixed that dent, obviously. Just a, a really a nice, nice older unit. Just on the edge of the thing there, you see, just from people's feet kind of clicking it. Uh, a couple little marks there. Oops, show you this one as well. Yeah, the overall just a beautiful unit. And it is obviously wet, but I try to point out any little marks. I don't even see any marks on the hood. A couple tiny, tiny, little teeny weeny things. So I got to really look. Okay, let's show you the inside. This one's got the tan leather interior. Has the upgraded JBL audio system. You know, leather a little uh, worn, but certainly not in bad condition for the year at all. Looks like they had restitched that. So for the year obviously not new but man alive in, in real good shape for that obviously the driver's seat's always the toughest one that seat looks fantastic the inside of this too just to show you i mean it's really 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 nice okay that back window does go up and down too on that which is pretty cool again this one does have that one month 1000 mile bumper to bumper warranty on it Just, you know, normal wear on the seats. They get a little bit of kind of wear lines in them. Not necessarily cracks, but kind of a wear line. And it is this, just show you that middle seat. It's that 60-40 folding rear seat. When you pull this forward, that seat flips and then it'll flip up from there. And I apologize, I can't reach the little lever. And then that flips up, then they can get into the back. And there, there's your back. And then that's a 50-50 split on those back seats. So, I'll show you up here. Headliner looks real clean. There's your DVD player. Here's your uh, rear um, uh, controls for your climate control. Giant sunroof on this thing, it's just huge. And then, if you could tell over there, and the, I just had got to look at that. A couple little scratches on the front of the glove box, obviously not the end of the world, but all right. There's the rest of the look of it. I tell you what, I'll keep you posted if it's still available or not, okay? I really appreciate it, you guys. Have an awesome day.